FM, AM 1160, WCCSradio.com. Boy, I, I said Clinton told me he's bringing someone with him, and I can't remember who. Man, did, did you, I mean, you're second place now. Chrissy's with us. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm fine with that. That's good. <laughs> Clinton Thank Smith, you. Chrissy Struzzi with us this morning. <laughs> Our conversation is brought to you by Marcus and Mac, voted best personal injury law firm in the best of Indiana County contest. Marcus and Mac, a law firm representing injured people. Well, folks, I like the name of this event. This is so much fun. The Giddy Up Wild Wild West fundraiser for the Alice Paul House. Oh, jeez. Uh, I've got images just going through my brain right now, Clinton. I, uh, I'm going to have my cowboy boots on. I have a sleeveless Western shirt already, and I'm going to have, like, some Daisy Duke jean cut-off cut oh, shorts. So that's not the I'm image ready. I wanted. <laughs> Gee. <laughs> wow. When is this thing? This sounds like a lot of fun. This is Thursday, June 15th, uh, 530 to 830. Mm -hmm. It's at the barn on Rain Run Road. Oh, it's a nice place. Yeah. It's yeah. a really nice place. Uh, and the Alice Paul House. You can't beat that as a right. fundraiser, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 So um, let's get this part right at the beginning and then we'll get it again at the end. How can people go? Um, so to get tickets, you just have to contact the Alice Paul House at 724-349-4444. Mm -hmm. uh, the tickets are a $50 donation that gets you in the door and gives you access to all of the top prizes that we have. Um, and, and if you know Chrissy or myself or anyone that's on the board of the Alice Paul House, you can contact them to get tickets as well. Mm -hmm. But it's one week from today, so it's t we only have so many tickets left, and we're here to try to sell those remaining tickets. So All right. if you haven't bought one yet, get in contact with someone. You better hurry, too. A, right. a week is not a lot of time. Right, yeah. right. And the ticket cost is $50. But we have so many great like prizes, mm -hmm. so you can even still purchase a ticket. And if you can't attend, you can still win those prizes. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, but you want to go. Yeah. Yeah. You, <laughs> you don't have to, though, to win the t I mean, our top prizes are amazing. We have a $1,000 gift card for the Omni Bedford Springs Resort that's donated from In First Bank. Mm -hmm. Indiana Vac donated a, I believe, like $500 cordless vacuum. Uh, GCES uh, donated a PlayStation 5 console. And then uh, we also have a Weber Traveler Grill donated from DeMeo's Fire Food and Fun. And there's also $600 in cash giveaways that we're going to do throughout the night while you're there. And those things, you just to buy the ticket, you don't have to show up. Mm -hmm. You can win those prizes with just buying the ticket. Yeah. Right, right. And yeah. during our event, we're going to have a basket raffle and 50-50 as well. Wow, okay. Wow. Yep. This is this sounds it's like a it's a big event. It's yeah. going to raise a lot of money for, right, for, sure. for a really, really worthy organization, too. Mm -hmm. uh, Alice Paul House does such wonderful work. We were very lucky that uh, Linda Glasser and Chuck Glasser that own the barn at Rain Run, they also offered to let us use the venue for free. So, Oh, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. That's going to be huge for us because that's usually where, in fundraising, you lose most of your money paying for the venue, and mm -hmm. we don't have to do that. So... We're trying to make a lot of money for the Alice Paul House in one event. This is probably going to be the only fundraising event the Alice Paul House does this entire year. Oh, okay. So it makes it really, really important. Yeah. So what's going to be actually happening at the event? Well, we have Wave Rider DJ Services. Mm -hmm. They're going to be playing probably Western music, I would think, country music. Mm -hmm. um, you can dance if you want to. We have a dance floor. Um, Cunningham Meats is providing a smoked pig with all the sides and dessert as mm. well. Um I'm forgetting. We're also having a cowboy uh, Moscow mule. Oh. We're calling it a cowboy mule, but it's a specialty drink. Yep. And Luxembourg's is um, they provided the tumblers. I was going to say I don't drink, yeah. so I have no idea what he just said. <laughs> it's like a Moscow mule, but we renamed it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but there will be a variety of drinks, not all alcoholic. So uh -huh. yeah, uh -huh. yeah. And and I'm assuming if uh, somebody has a cowboy hat, they should be wearing it that yeah. night. Yes. Yep. Cowboy hats, belt buckles, suits. Boots. Yeah, no flannels. Yeah. <laughs> Might be too hot for flannels. Yeah. <laughs> Chrissy has banned flannels for the night. <laughs> uh, but it, it does sound like just a blast. And, and again, it's June 15th, which is uh, just a few days away. One week from today. Yep. Yeah. 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 It starts at 530 and uh, we're ending it at 830. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Yeah, yeah, so, and, and I want to give a shout out to like a couple more sponsors. We sure. have Holiday Beverage. They are providing all the um, beer and everything for the for the event. 
Mm-hmm. Then we have Catalancia Orthodontics, uh, the 700 shop, and then Indiana Floral and Flower Boutique, uh, Julie Silvis, is going to provide all of the centerpieces. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The barn at Rain Run, um, for folks who don't know, it's it's a beautiful location, isn't it? It is. It's so country. It's uh, it, it, We love it. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's an absolutely gorgeous place to be. If anybody doesn't know, it's in Marion Center, too. Yeah. 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 And it's it's a it's a just a lovely place, and uh, so folks will a- enjoy that evening. Um, and you're getting them home in the daylight, right? That's one nice yeah. thing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So a a good time coming a week from today. That's next Thursday mm-hmm. at yeah. the barn at Rain Run. Yeah, Wonderful. let's talk a- about Alice Ballhouse and why people, um, well, might not know, but but should uh, that how valuable an organization Alice Ballhouse is for Indiana County. Right. Well, they promote awareness um, through domestic violence, um, sexual assault, and uh, victimization in our community through um, prevention, primary prevention, and educational programs. Mm -hmm. They assist and empower uh, victims of crime, and they provide safety to those that are victims of domestic violence and sexual assault. Yeah, yeah. They've got the new facility. Yes, uh, That is, you know, of course, uh, those, those sorts of places they require a uh, certain amount of funding just to keep them going. Uh, yeah. And yeah. when you're in a mission such as the mission that they have, uh, then you, you really, really need to go out and, and aggressively raise funds. So that makes this really, really important. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And a lot of people have often thought that the Alice Paul House is really just a abused or battered women's shelter, but it mm-hmm. honestly is so much more than that. Um, they do a lot of stuff to prevent those things from happening, but then they're also involved in, in – the legal processes and stuff like that to help people with getting PFAs and really assisting the families and women or men or Mm -hmm. uh, any part of the community, anyone that's a victim of domestic violence or sexual assault, helping them get through that process in the legal ways too, that things that happen, you know, not just getting out of the situation, but what do you do to protect yourself legally as well? Yeah. They know the system and they know how to work within it to make sure that people are safe, not only, uh, women, uh, but as you said, Clinton, men, and 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 most importantly, or or as importantly as anything else, the kids who are involved in this. So. Right, right, and it's it's kind of like when we became involved, we didn't know obviously like that men stayed there and children and all that. So whenever you're involved and you learn all that, that's pretty that's pretty good to know. Like that, you know, even men are staying there. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's why we're calling this a fundraising event because we're trying to have fun to raise funds for the for the mission of the Alice Paul House. Mm-hmm. Big question: Will there be a mechanical bull there? Oh, we Man. thought about it, <laughs> but the insurance is yeah ridiculous. So or will, yeah, <laughs> will Clinton just volunteer for someone to jump on his back? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I will throw him around, but I I don't know if we have the insurance policy for that. <laughs> and we literally did bring up the mechanical bull to Linda. Yeah. Linda's like, eh, I don't think so. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I knew people would be thinking of it, though. Yeah. yeah. But but it's a it's a great theme, uh, and it should be a wonderful night. It, it really should. The weather's going to be good, too. Um, it might be a rainy day, but that's okay. You're inside the We're barn. Inside, right. And it's not going to be blazing hot. Right. Uh, so you'll have a good weekend, a good day, a day yeah. for that. So that is a week from today. It is the Giddy Up Wild Wild West Fundraiser. Clinton, give us again the ticket information. So it's $50. You can purchase a ticket by calling the Alex Paul House at 724-349-4444. Or if you know Christina Struzzi or myself, Clinton Smith, you can call us, message us on Facebook to get tickets. There are only a few left. so And we're only selling 300 tickets. So now's your chance to get one and help support the community. Mm-hmm. You want to you wanna go ahead, Chrissy? I it's Struzzi. I know. Struzzy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you just seen her face. Oh my gosh! And we've been friends for seven years now. Yeah. He still can't get right. It did take you three years to correct me the right. first time. <laughs> uh, well, both of you uh, have been uh, the chairpersons of the uh, that United Way of Indiana County fundraiser, yep. and yep. Uh, and so you know, uh, working with United Way, what a big part of the community the Alice Fall House is. So it, it it's just a such a great, great, worthwhile organization. So many volunteers that make it work, uh, and they're, I mean, you you ring the number, they're going to answer. It doesn't matter what day, time mm-hmm. of day it is. Uh, they're, yeah. they're always there for you. They're, Indiana's a great community. We, we both got to learn that doing work with the United Way. Chrissy and I have gotten to work together on tons of fundraising events. 
Um, we're a great team at this point, even though I can't get her last name right sometimes. Uh, <laughs> but, if she messes up your last name, Mr. Smith, right. yeah. <laughs> we're, in, we're in real trouble. Clinton Smythe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, I did want to mention we did get so we have all those other sponsors. We have some cash sponsors too that donated uh-huh. to the event, um, and I, I want to make sure I mention them. McNaughton Brothers and Stokes Retirement also donated money for us to put this event on, yeah. and they're our main main sponsors. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah and the uh, the money sponsors are Commissioners Robin Gorman and Mike Keith, mm-hmm. and then we have uh, Good and Associates. Wonderful. Wonderful. A lot of folks coming together to make this happen. Again, it is June 15th, a week from today. The barn at Rain Run, it is from 5.30 to, what did you say, 8.30? 8.30. 8.30. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and and if, you're, if you need a physical address to get there, 2475 Rain Run Road, uh, Marion Center. Uh, so it's a, it's a great event. I hope a lot of folks uh, will respond. And how many tickets do we need to get rid of here today, Clinton? I've, I'm thinking about 100, about 100 from more. our last count. Yeah. We still have some out to board members, so we're not sure how many the board members have sold, Mm -hmm. but we're collecting those. And I think you can get tickets up until probably the day of, and Mm -hmm. we'll probably have some extra tickets tickets available at the door, too. Yeah. Yeah. Get them now. Yeah. That's a good plan. Good plan. Hey, thanks to both of you for coming in. Thank you so much. Uh, Yeah. And maybe we'll welcome Representative Jim Struzzi in to visit with us. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) It's Indiana in the morning. It's WCCS 101.1 FM, AM 1160, and WCCS Radio. Dot com. Fox News is next at the top of the hour, and then Josh in the newsroom.